Yeah. Thomas, it's Farrell. Running from the Bureau will do no good. You know we'll find you eventually. Look, I understand. The case load became too much. You weren't solving cases like you used to. You're talented, high strung. You snapped. It happens sometimes. Look, I did not snap. Someone else killed those policemen. I, it looks like it might have been the matchmaker. With your gun? That seems unlikely, doesn't it? We have psychiatric staff that can help you sort things out. With all due respect, I don't need a shrink. Look, Farrell. This isn't Farrell. It's Malcolm Van Horn. Has your boss been bothering you? Yes. To be expected. They're not going to let this drop. You must continue with your investigation. Do you understand? <laughs> Do you understand? Yes. I mean, no. What do you want from me, Malcolm? What's going on? Going on? You're being investigated by the FBI for the murder of two police officers. That's what's going on. You will be tested, Thomas. Of that you can be sure. I must go.
Get it. What, what does that mean? I'm not sure. I'm just saying that the print from the tape recorder wasn't made by the same hand.
would if I could, but this part of the department store is flooded. His trail ends here. It might be a long shot, but try using your gas spectrometer. Dead bodies start decaying immediately, producing hydrogen sulfide and traces of methane. If there's a body, 
You should be able to sniff it out. The air sample contains usual city pollutants and high concentrations of mold spores, and here we go. Methane. It's relatively weak, but definitely there. doesn't look 
look like it's a recent loss either. This guy's the matchmaker. Well, he certainly didn't kill himself and set it up this way. See what else you can find. What is it? Too early to call. Small particles that show up as a potential organophosphate pesticide. I'll work more on that and see what we get. We're not even here. Give yourself up! cross off the matchmaker. Wait, are you implying that there's someone stalking serial killers? So what, he goes around killing killers and then he marks off their name in his little personal diary? It sounds ridiculous, doesn't it? It does, but it adds up. It almost makes sense. Hold on. Ah, oh, shit. Rosa, I have to call you back. Yeah. 